morning, everybody. It's DJ NV Charlemagne the Guy. We are the Breakfast Club. We got our guest co-host Monty Mills with us this morning. Monty, what's up? What's up? Now we didn't say welcome this morning because you were still getting uh, your makeup put on. But good morning. <laughs> yes, good morning. For people just joining us, you're on one one on one point one in Nashville. The beat I Nashville. Am. I am. Yeah. White Atlanta. Director. I call it Nashville say, White Atlanta. The White Atlanta. Yeah, White Atlanta. Why? Because it feels like White Atlanta. No, it does not. When I go. But that's like he want to know where the black people at. A, a second, that is bounce. true. Maybe it's a, definitely culture. A day or so in, in Nashville. Mm-hmm. Two days, definitely. Now you're the uh, music director and a host over there. I am. Yep. Okay. And you're pregnant. Congratulations. I Thank seen, you. I was looking at your page yesterday, and you were talking about you know how it's been difficult the last uh, thirty days, right? Well, she about to bust in a moment. Yeah, I see. Not thirty days. Literally, this pregnancy in general has been hard on me. And it's it's your, my fourth one. Oh, it's your my fourth, fourth one. pregnancy. Mm-hmm. Really? Yeah, I'm, I'm vetted up in here, you know. But um, it's just been difficult in general. I don't know because I got more kids. Because I'm getting older. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, not only. I'm eight months. Eight months. I guess. Well, because you're pregnant. Four weeks. I don't know what the what the terms is. Because you're pregnant and you still got to be a mom, so you still got to do <laughs> exactly. the things that you know you you can't say I can't do. You got to do because exactly. you you're mom. I have toddlers. I have a four year old and a two year old. So all of that and pregnancy is a lot. But no more. I'm done. You done? I'm done. <laughs> Charlemagne has four. I have six. Yeah, I'm not getting there. No, I'm done. I'm not getting it. Four is good. We're like done. We're done at four. Yeah, we good. I'm done now. I got a five year old and two year old, so I understand. Oh, yeah. It's yeah. it's real. It's definitely real. All right. Well, let's get to the rumors. Let's go. <laughs> this is the rumor report. She on the tea. How you feel, Monty? It's gone. What's up? Good morning. I just wonder how crazy this is going to get. On the Breakfast Club. You you know what's gonna be crazy, Monty. Oh, head, it's your time, baby. It's your time, baby. Okay, period. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so entertainment, we're talking more Jada. How y'all feeling about talking about more Jada? I mean, yeah. the book drops today, so I feel like we kind of have mm-hmm. to talk about She keeps giving us stuff to talk about. Mm-hmm. So she made a few promo stops to defend her relationship with Will. It seems like things are kind of, I don't know, changing perspectives a little bit. She pulled up on Fat Joe to get her terror squad, Air Force Ones, and while she was there, she kind of cleared some things up. Let's check it out. Me and Will, we are in such a good place. That's not what the tabloids are saying. But that's that's the tabloids. (laughs) And so everybody's sticking to, you know, we split up. We've been separated. So it's like... So they running with it. They running with that. And it's like, we have been separated but guess what after the oscars we are back together we came back to a whole place that little little thing boy he got he got a little gangster there he (laughs) said yo well you know i'm about to take you back (laughs) Ah! he said i'm about to take i'm about to take you back will we did so much healing together there's been an energy shift. You know why there's been an energy shift? Why you think? Because there was a conversation in the Smith household. <laughs> nobody can tell me different. Oh, you think Will called him? Like, hey, and nobody can fix tell this. me different. She went back on the Today Show. But after I feel being like Jay on the Today Show last running week, her, running the show. I don't believe. Uh, I, I don't know who's running the show. I just know that there was a conversation had in that household because there was an energy shift for Fat Joe. There was an energy, energy shift on Colbert, and she went back on the Today Show with Holder yesterday after mm-hmm. just being there last week. So you think Will Willie Will come on, called man? And said, come on, y'all got hey, common sense. Up. Y'all got common sense. But- I don't know. I feel like, like I said, I don't know. It just seems like Jada's running things. I don't know why the turn of events, why she's changing her mind all of a sudden and kind of going back on those things. But, I mean, it could have to do with the book release. It was a conversation had in that house. I don't know. But you're a pinky, Smith, we, Carter, no like something. She runs, she, got, she wears the, pan, the pants in the house. Don't we have a clip from the Today Show? <laughs> yes. Me and Pop would never an item. Oh! This is no. Fat Joe. That's Fat Joe again. That's Fat Joe. We are in a place now that we are in a deep healing space. And we are really concentrating on healing the relationship between us. So it may not be the divorce on paper anymore? There's no divorce on paper. I mean, not on paper. There might not be a divorce in theory anymore. Yeah, no, we really have been working hard. You were divorced, not on paper. But now we might be a point where we're back together. We are working very hard at bringing our relationship, yes, bringing our relationship together. Back to a marriage again. Back to a life partnership. I'm telling you, Jada Pinkett Smith was just on today's show with Hoda last week, <laughs> mm-hmm. saying she's been separated from Will for seven years or however long it was, and then you pop back on the Today Show yesterday, singing a different tune. There was a talk in that house. I believe Brother Will said you need to go clean all that up. You know what I'm saying? And I don't know if the conversation was as in, was as intense as Will when he was mad at his father leaving him again, mm-hmm. but a conversation was clearly had. 
I mean, well, I, I guess I guess some type of conversation was mm-hmm. had to, mm-hmm. to be, but I don't know, like you said, I mean, like the audio said, they're working on a life partnership, which has us pretty much confused because even with the Oscar slap thing, she was like that she was confused about Will being so upset because he hadn't called her wife, his wife in some time. So now with her saying that they're working on this partnership after the Oscars, I don't know. It doesn't make a lot of there sense. There was a me. conversation had in that house. <laughs> if Jada had that neuralizer from Men in Black, she would be hitting us all with it right now. To make us forget everything she said last week. Well, you know who's Jesus. tired of all the Jada slander? Her Whoa. mama, okay? She's tired of everybody coming for her baby, and so she stepped in to defend Jada. But I do want to start out as your mama, right, to clarify some things, because I'm a little tired of all the vitriol being thrown your way. I'm right. sick of it. Right. And I just want to say that, you know, when you guys decided to separate, okay, that was a decision that both of you made, you're both separated. You did not cheat on Will. Right. You're both, both parties are living their lives, both. Mm-hmm. Okay, so it's not just you, and I need to make that really clear. And, you know, with I, big ups <laughs> to moms on defending her baby because she is getting a lot of backlash right now. Yeah, but stuff like that just makes you uh, want to ask more questions. Well, you know what that sounds like? That sounds like y'all were both living your life. Like, yeah, you did your little thing on the side because y'all were separated. So it was no cheating. But Will had his thing on the side as well. Y'all both had separate lives. The that's what it sounds like. The difference is Will's thing on the side didn't do an interview with nobody and tell I know, everybody. that's the thing. That's all it boils down to. That's I facts. just feel like we're getting too much information at one time that just, like you said, it's just leaving us to ask more and more questions. Well, guess what? What? Jada won. I am sold. <laughs> Amazon yeah. will be delivering my copy of Worthy between 2 p.m. and 6 p.m. today. She did okay. what she had to do. I'm sure it's going to be a lot of people buying that book. Yeah, so. I'm getting my copy today, too. <laughs> it will be delivered between 2 and 6 p.m. today. Okay, I was in the middle of reading Don Miguel Ruiz's The Shaman's Path to Freedom. I put that to the side to get to work. All right, <laughs> you won, Jada. You won. The book rollout was incredible. I've never seen a book rollout. I know, like this. right? One of the Ever. best. One of the best. Ever. Well, I feel like people are still kind of questioning some things. I know Jada was really open about a lot of her in her past, including selling drugs. And so Jim Jones, he questioned, you know, if Jada really so crack. Oh boy. My whole thing is, if you sold crack in the nineties, nine times out of ten. There's still some crackheads in the neighborhood that can vouch that you were selling that butter. I don't know where Jada grew up at, but we need to go check and see. Um, they got some fiends that can verify that she was selling that thing back in the. Uh, she had that butter. She had that butter on the block for sale. Now, Mister Jada selling crack thing. No, she said that. Yeah, she, she said. Talked about. Yeah, she said okay. she didn't want to be a drug dealer's uh, girlfriend. That, that you know, was she. Got the clip? Hey, we got the clip. Even though I always had a regular job, I just wanted more financial freedom. I decided to sell drugs. So she was selling dope so her uh, brother could go to college? So why she end up sleeping with that man then? What? Sleeping mm. with what man? You we ain't about to that? talk about no, no. We ain't about to talk about that. This is not remember a movie. This is not a movie. This is not a movie, Remember bro. when her brother wanted to go to college? Oh, my goodness. Remember when her brother was going to go to college? And Everything's oh, not fresh Prince of Bel-Air. Everything's 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 not fresh Prince of Bel-Air. I do remember. That's another movie. You can't put... Oh, oh. Putting too many movies in the same mix. I ain't seen her sell no crack, man. I seen her sleep with that man to get the money for her brother to go to college. He didn't want to go no more. He ended up getting shot, man. That's what I remember, man. No, that was the same movie. She got away. She did at the end. She did get away at the but end. But her brother yeah. died, though. Her yeah, brother he did, did die. die. That was real sad. Mm-hmm. Anyways, last thing I want to talk about, which this, I have mixed feelings about it because J. Cole, of course, he has the infamous line, I want that Jada and that Will love, you know? And I feel like as these things were happening, people were talking about that line as if it, you know, is it credible anymore? Well, he performed it live and he actually left that part out. I want a real love. Y'all Damn, the crowd. <laughs> the crowd ain't even singing. I know. <laughs> I have no problem with J. Cole suspending that line for no, the time being. Nah, but y'all <laughs> don't. <laughs> no, you got to suspend know. that line for the time being. Until we read Worthy and see what the hell going on, we got to suspend that line for the but time being. But y'all know as a rapper and performer, there's times where he doesn't say things and the crowd says it. The crowd didn't say it. The crowd didn't say anything. The crowd said that's still up that's up, for, uh, that's up in the air for now. All right. Okay? Well, that the jury's still out is your on if report. we want that Jade and that Will love right now. Yo, I don't think nobody up, wants that right now. You got to read Worthy oh, first. Boy. I want a real love. Y'all skinny and big love. That Jade and that Will, I'll 
there for him. Well, that ain't the, the crowd like, Ugh. yeah. <laughs> All right. Oh, no. When we come back, we got front page news. <laughs> they don't know if they want Jaden Will Love or Jaden and Pac Love at this point. But we got to read Worthy first. That's right. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right, front page news when we come back. It's The Breakfast Club. Good morning. Wake that ass up. Early in the morning. The Breakfast Club.